So here it is. It's so bad. Uh, holy cow, it needs organization so bad. So I keep my cleaning supplies under here. I keep some of, of my cooking supplies under here, like oils and stuff. Like this is like vegetable oil. And like I have um, some olive oil like way back there and some tissues. And then I keep dog stuff over here and paper towels and trash bags and everything is under here. It is just a mess. So I'm going to declutter this space, organize this space with 31 products and show you guys how it looks when it's done. So keep watching. Okay, so I decided to shed some light on the situation because it was a little dark in here. So what I'm going to do first is pull everything out and then I'm going to sort it all by cleaning supplies, dog, and household goods food. So that's the first thing I'm going to do. So you're gonna see that next. Okay, so here it is, we can get a focus. Here it is all cleaned out. I actually took a wet rag and some cleaning solution that I made um, and it's filthy now because I've got my rag in it but it's just Dawn dish soap and um, some vinegar and I actually put a few drops of my Purify essential oil and I use the ones from Eden's Garden um, and I can get into why I use Eden's Garden over other brands later but that's just what I've chosen. Okay, so back to the products that I'm using. As I was saying, everything is in the Diddy dot print, which is this black. My lighting is horrible, but I'm using a lamp to like light up under here because there's no light. I have it's black with white polka dots. So these are the things I have. I have a Your Way display bin, which is this box. It's very, um, it's very like nice because it's just a basic box. It's shallow so that you can stand things up in it. It just keeps everything together and organized, but it has like sturdy sides, so it's not going to fall over. Um, but it does have handles on the side, but I don't know if I would use this to like carry stuff around or not. Um, but it's a little bit taller in the back than it is the front. And then I have two of these and these are called catch-all bins and that's a handle at the top that you can open and you can carry it around with you. Um, so I got two of those and the one I did get, I'm so pleased with myself, like whenever I do something I'm funny. So the dust bunnies ate my last cleaning fairy. So this one's actually going to be used for my cleaning supplies as I sit down on top of my vegetable oil. But I am like in love with this bin just because of what it says because Lord knows there's tons of dust bunnies in my house. And then I also got this mini catch-all bin in the same print and that one is just a tinier version Obviously like it's like the baby to the catch-all bin and I also got a little Carry-all caddy, which is another little handheld caddy. So I'm not really sure how I want to put these in here um, But I'm gonna go ahead and start messing around and figure it out And then I'll come back in and show you guys what I figure out and walk you through it still really cool I mean I know I can scale down um, I'm not gonna like dispose of perfectly good like I'm starting to move to more natural cleaning products just because that's just what like I said earlier I was doing um, so like I've really been into like the method cleaners um, but I'm not gonna throw away some of my like I haven't used this in ages but like I'm not gonna throw it away because it's still perfectly good so I'll make sure now that I've got it in this caddy to, this is what I used to fill my steam lock. Um, but now that they have it in this caddy, I can just pull it out and, you know, grab it by the handle and go. Um, and once, like, once I use it through, I'll dispose of this. Like, I'll get, I'll make sure I specifically use this and get rid of it. Um, again, like, I've got one Mr. Clean Magic Eraser in this box. Like, I could take it out of the box, but then it's just going to take up, you know, it's just going to get dirty. Same with these dusting cloths. You know, it's taking up a lot of space. Um, I, I'm not so fond of these. I don't know if I would necessarily like replace, like buy them again, but I'm not gonna throw them away. Like I'm gonna use them because you know that's just wasteful. Like you can see, like I got cleaning products the whole way back. Then I have a half-used wood cleaner here. I have another half-used wood cleaner back there. Look that they're different products. So I just need to start scaling down and sticking to one thing that I like that works. Um, and then my little catch-all bin with all my trash bags fits perfectly right here. Um, I have it kind of 
tucked in behind the lip here to kind of keep it in there. But normally I don't have two types of trash bags, but I've got these for some special projects I'm doing around the house, so I want to have those there. These are cleaning supplies that, like, obviously I'm not going to carry around the house. So, like, extra tissues, roll of toilet, or paper towel, light balls. There's some, like, plant food back here, um, stuff to clean my Keurig, you know, rubber gloves, a new sponge for my sink, dishwasher, you know, stuff like that. Like, I'm not going to carry that around the house. So that's going to stay in the stationary bin. I put, like, all my, like, pesticides in the very back. Unfortunately, like, I live in the country, so I have to have pesticides on hand. Um, it's just what I have to do. So then I put my two oils right up front. Ugh, ignore my dirty floor. Like, I unearthed some grossness in here, let me tell you. Um, so now I'm going to have to wash my floor. I like how one project turns into another project. So back here is all my dog stuff so like this is vinegar i use that um for cleaning sometimes i put it in my washer although i had just heard that that's not a good thing to do and that's my dog so now, as i was saying before i was interrupted got my dog stuff back here um doggy related cleaner collars bath bathing stuff their sweaters because they're a little in there um so it's all organized now it's all nice and neat Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you got some inspiration uh, with all these organizing bins. And um, like I said, I hope to thin it out a little bit and not have quite so many things. Um, but we'll keep working on that as we go. And I hope you all have a fabulous day.